Hey, what's going on, guys? Mr. Lumpy Koala, and this is Clash Royale, and it's been almost a week now, so that's pretty sweet. Um, this isn't the deck that I was just messing around trying to get an all-epic deck, but this is the deck that I've been using uh, to get up here. I Let's see, I hit my highest trophy count, which is right there. It says it below the three crown wins. Uh... 2,227, so we're going to do a live attack today, also, um, we're going to go over a few attacks, and what I did wrong, and what I, um, didn't do wrong, so, um, okay, so, here's this victory, um, let's first, okay, so I went on a, okay, so let's, down here, I went on a victory. Okay, okay, I'm all over the place. Um, we're going to watch this. Um, okay, it's sideways. Oops. Here, figure this out with me, guys. Okay. Uh, is, is it settings? Yes, yeah, settings. Okay, let's do that. Perfect. Holy cow, it's been a while. Um. So we can. Oops, we watched a victory. Okay, so we, I guess we'll watch this one first. Um, so here we are reversing uh, Isbo. We'll call him Isbo, because that sounds funny. Um, so basically, to defend, we throw down arrows, and then we put the minions as the stuff's coming by. Um, so he puts down a... Um, okay, we'll catch back up. Okay, so we have... So we put down the... Uh, Spear goblins to counter the dragon, which didn't really work, so we put down a uh, knight to uh, distract, but then he puts down all of his uh, skeleton army. Um, so his baby dragon didn't touch the tower, but at this point, I think we're going to put down another skeleton hut or a, a hut of some sort. Okay, instead, we put down the uh, minions to. No, yeah, to take out the barbarians. This, uh, he puts down more goblins to take out my mini horde. Um, it's, it becomes a elixir, and I believe I put down my. Oh no, we just go for a big push. So that's cool. Um, we put down a knight by that musketeer. My, our barbarians are going towards the tower, but he puts down a skeleton army to distract. And that's okay. Um, so we put on a second goblin hut to distract this dragon. So that's cool. Uh, we take him out successfully. He comes. He puts. He goes for big push. Valkyrie with barbarians. Um, and so I put down. Oh, I thought. Oh yeah, I do put down barbarians and minions to counter. Um, so as I'm going, I'm gonna add to this push, and I'm going to try and take it out. But what happens? I remember something. Oh yeah, okay. So he takes out everything, um, including all that. So everything's just on the side. It's going to go into overtime, and that's fine. I just kept putting down troops, and here's a push of um, minions and barbarians. He puts down his skeleton army. I put down a knight on the left side and with all of these goblins. We're going to take out these spear goblins, and I believe we're going to take this tower. So, that was super awesome. Uh, we shoot over the barbarians with that Kobe. The Kobe. Oh. I don't remember that happening. Okay, so I quickly threw down the arrow, and then our, we throw one more, one last arrow to take, take the win. I actually remember that because he threw the goblin barrel, and I threw down the arrow. Okay, so, I played that pretty well. Um, considering what he had, well, ooh, okay, we're gonna front, we're, instead of doing the live attack, we're just gonna battle him, uh, this is going to be sweet, okay, uh, he doesn't even know this, but he's on video right now, uh, I'll probably put his link down in the description, he puts on a giant, so, honestly, giant, I honestly think the giant's crap, and same with uh, the 
witches. So I'm just going to quickly put down barbarians and um my uh, knight. Um, and we're going to start a little bit of a push. Left side, he puts down skeleton uh, army. That's fine. I think we're going to take it out. Yep, for a hard rider to get to his tower and hopefully start getting some damage done. Our, we're going to start throwing some Kobe's and hopefully do a lot of damage. Oh, holy cow, I think we're going to take this tower, guys. Wow. Okay, so we took the tower. We're going to put down another Goblin Hut. Uh, our Spear Goblins are going to take out the Dragon, but the, it does throw down a Dunker and kills half of my... We're going to put this right up here to take out his uh, Inferno Tower. Um, then he's going to try to counter. I'm going to put down... We're going to go for the 3-star, just because we can. Um, he's going to throw it on that. So, basically, uh, we're just going to... We could just defend, but that's really how I don't like to play that way. So, we're going to put down minions, knight. We're going to try to get down this goblin hut. Um, we're going to try to get this goblin hut down. Um, so, that's sweet. So, our knight is on the king's tower. That's sweet. Um, we're throwing some Kobe's at that um, dragon. So, that's cool. Also, I'm going to put down the inferno tower um, right there to take out this dragon. And then, hopefully, we can just hold this out and, if not, get two towers. He's going to drop his witch giant combo. We're going to quickly put down... That to take out the witch, uh, cause we can't deal with her. Right now we're gonna put down the skeleton or the minion horde to take out that giant. We're going to start a push, uh, on this left map here. Uh, we're gonna put down another goblin hut. That push didn't do much, um, so we're gonna throw a, some arrows to take out that uh, skeleton army. Um, let's see. Okay, so we're gonna put down a uh, inferno tower to take out that giant. Um, we're going to put down some spear goblins to distract this musketeer to hopefully take that. Um, he's going to throw some arrows, which was really poor decision. Um, I'm going to put some down some of those. We're going to take the win with a one star. Um, one thing I would like to say is you guys don't have to worry about, um, about getting a lot of stars. Or crowns, whatever they're called. Um, so... You don't have to worry about getting them because as all you need is that win. And I know the crown chest is a lot. It'd be nice to go get that three crown or whatever. Um, but that really isn't as important as just pulling out with the win. Um, yeah, so we're going to type to him and say, you're... In my new vid. Sweet. Sweet. Okay. That is perfect. Um, we're going to go over this defeat and what I could have done better. This guy used an expo. It's just one of those. Uh, I Okay. I'm, I want to throw up thinking about people that use the, that thing. Okay. So we're going to jump in. Um, Lil L Bimbo. Write that down in the comment. Okay, you can't really write down there how it's pronounced. Okay, so he's going to drop down his witch. I'm going to drop the Inferno Tower. Uh, poor choice, but I think that what I normally do is put down Barbarians on that witch. Take out the witch. Witches are not that great of a troop if you deal with them correctly. Wait for them to get on your side. Drop a Barbarian or a Minion Horde on them. You can even do normal Minions. Because, excuse me. That You see how fast those got taken out. And... Uh, if you need to counter a minion horde with minion horde, I don't think it's a good way to counter them, considering it's five elixir on five elixir, and you want to counter for cheaper. But um, you, d I just worry about getting done what's getting done. But um, we're going to see what happens. So this inferno tower, uh, right here, I put next to the tower to defend. Um, he drops the skeleton right there. Um, so I put down the Barbarians to ride on him to take him out. As you can see how much damage that does. So good. Um, so that did, and then I see the Expo, so I panic. Put down a Knight to distract it. 
it actually does a pretty good job, so I'm going to drop down the Spear Goblins behind to take out the Expo. If you guys, if you guys see an Expo, you guys, it's the one time that I think that you should panic, because... You need to get something down as quickly as possible. And this night, this prince comes down. I'm sadly, it's gonna get his charge off. I'm not even sure if I'm gonna be countering it because, uh, and I actually remember because this is what killed me is letting that prince is not countering that prince. If I would have countered that prince, then I'm pretty sure I, w I wouldn't have lost. But we have to counter this witch. Uh, we're gonna do it with those minions. Uh, we're gonna drop them right on her head. Um, so that's a good, a super good way to counter. And of course, the stupid person I am, mid battle, knowing that he's got his crossbow ready, um, I was thinking, okay, we just got to push mid map. We just got to push the map. He drops down a skeleton. Boom! There goes all of my troops. Super bad. Um, that skeleton is really crucial if you use him right. So he drops in another expo, and I could, I don't know, I should have dropped. Okay, so oh, I do get the. Barbarian's down. He's going to counter it with that. We're going to take out the expo. I didn't... Okay, so then we drop the Donnie Spear Goblins to hopefully try to counter it. It doesn't happen. But we put down this uh, minion horde to try to go across. What does he do? He drops something. What does he do? Put the prince on this side. What do I do? Put my barbarians on that side. Boom. I can guarantee if I would have put those barbarians on this side, then I could have still pulled out the win, but I didn't. That's really, really rough. And, um, well, uh, depending on how much time we have in this video, uh, yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. Um, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.